Hey everyone, it's Donna, and today I'm doing my 60th birthday fix. Um, started out this morning, we've been having thunderstorms and some wind, and it's been kind of cool. It, it, it feels like fall outside. I don't know where, where you guys are at, but I love fall, so it's kicking in there. My birthday isn't actually for a couple, a few more days, but it's coming up, and I thought I'm going to do my fix, and that way if I need to do another one, I can do it. And, um, but we'll see what, we'll see what Jason sent to me. Um, this time he thought he'd, uh, stretch my horizons out of farther. He sent me some neon and I, I'm not a big neon person. And he also sent me some more heels. Mm. Um, the one thing about heels that I, I can't, I, it's hard for me to wear them because I am a diabetic and I have to keep, I like my feet in comfortable shoes. I don't know. Or it's just a matter of my health issues. So I just, I'm kind of leery. He looks like he sent me some, some wedge heels and gosh, if I were to fall on those, my feet would be gone. Um, so I'm a little worried about that, but I'm going to show you what he sent me and it's cute stuff. So I'm excited to try it on. So here is what we have this time. I cover up my message because I want that private. Um, but there's that little sweater. I've got a necklace in there. Um, it looks like he sent me a, like a, a cardigan, like it looks camo, and so these wedge heels, ah, and then an asymmetrical top in black. So I'm kind of excited to see it. So let's get started, and I'll read these off, and we'll see what's, what's going on. I've got my price list. If I were to buy this entire box with a discount, I have no styling fee. It's been waived. It would be uh, with... Uh, shipping's free. It's um, $253.50, but then of course they always add tax to that, so it's always close to $300 for me. If I do something like that, I always have to add something else. But, okay, let's see what we got here. First of all, I got jewelry. Oh, oh I like jewelry. And then I got the shoes. Okay. And then I've got the bundle. And this actually came in last night, but I wanted to wait until we could open this together and here we are so let's start by let's tear this baby open because i like to see the clothing i want to see it first so here we go seal still intact i wait for you guys every time okay and i still miss that little tissue paper that when they first began that they used to wrap around it because it was soft it was like really fun to tear open all right, but anyway, let's get started here. We have a 41 Hawthorne shirt, and it is in black. This little top is going to be called the, hmm, let me get my glasses. Maybe 60 has done something to my eyesight. It's the Osher Asymmetrical V-neck Knit Top. It's O-S-H-E-R. It's a size small. I wear a size four, so kind of even measure that with S. And it's, this is in black. This little top will cost you uh, $58. Pretty reasonable. Let's put these clothing pieces over here. Ooh, I like the fabric on this. It's like a, uh, it's like a knit. Um, I thought it would be more like a, it's like a, uh, a polyester. That's what I want to call it. But it's, it's cool feeling fabric. Okay, and of course it's got that cut at the bottom. He said that I should wear this with some black leggings and then put that little cardigan on top of it, which I plan to do. And oh, and look at the look at the cut at the top. Isn't that cute? I think I'm gonna like this. Kind of different. Okay, excited to try that on, Jason. Then we we've got the neon. This is by Design History, the Lizzie front seam pullover. It's in fuchsia, size small. And Design History is charging $68 for their little top. And that's pretty. It almost looks like it has a dolman type of sleeve to it. it. Looks pretty. I think that would... He suggested we were wearing this, these with uh, the black leggings that he sent to me. And I think this might be stinking cute. So we're going to see. Oh, I might, <laughs> I might like a little fuchsia in my life. What do you think? So, okay, next we're going to go to this. And this is a cardigan. It's by Sanctuary. It's the Sierra Ribbed Detail Cardigan in green. And this little cardigan is um, 
sanctuary. $98. Now, I was out yesterday shopping, and I kept seeing these long cardigans. I don't know if you all have seen these out and about, but I saw several of them in the stores. Um, I was looking at the prices of them, looking at the styles, and I, and I thought, well, you know, maybe I should buy one. I'll be interested to try this. He said to try it with this little black top and some leggings and some boots. Wouldn't that be cute for fall? Hmm. We'll see in a minute, because I'm going to do a try-on. So, okay. Then he sent me a necklace, and I will pop that on with some of this. I might try it with that uh, black top. Or the brown, the fuchsia. We'll see what this little thing looks. Oh, well, this is a little bit different. I thought, yeah. When I saw the picture, it looked like beads, but look, they're flat. They're a little flat. You know, I don't know what the plastic, hard plastic, but they're. Let me show them to you. There it is. They're really cute. That's cute. This little necklace is uh, by Flair, and it costs, and let's see what they call it. It's called the Lunar Necklace, and I can see why, because it looks like a little planet. It's in brown. It's $54. Hmm. That is a cute necklace. I've got some earrings that might look good with that, too. So, okay. And it has a little card about the, about the company or the earrings or... But I can't, <laughs> the print is too small. Again, I'm 60, so we're going to have to wait. So anyway, we're going to go to the shoes. The shoes. These big wedge heels. Will I die in these and not make it to 61? I don't know. Um, these shoes are called, these are by Report Footwear. These are the Edwardia Printed Side Wedge. Printed? Oh, slide wedge. Oops. Um, these are $60, and the color is gray, and these are a size 8. I'm a size 8 girl. There's the bottom. And I've had shoes by report before, and they're, they're, they're cute little shoes. So, okay, everybody, um, hang on a second, and I'm going to try this stuff on. I'm going to pull out my uh, black uh, leggings that he sent to me before. And um, I'm going to work some things around. I actually, in the, in the he suggested in um, that I put some cropped jean pants with one of that these tops. I went to I, I won't talk about, it, but I did find a pair somewhere else, and because I didn't buy it from the fix, and then I regretted that I didn't buy the the ripped up jeans from the last fix and the white top. I actually ran into almost a similar outfit in the same stores, and it. And I bought it. I thought I should have bought it when I had the chance. I didn't think I was going to have another chance, and so I, I, I bought it. So, and it was a little bit cheaper, but I had to really worry about was I going to be able to ever find that again. Anyway, hang on. <clears throat> Please subscribe, and I'll be right back, okay? Okay, we're getting ready to do the <clears throat> try-on thing. I've got the clothes on, but before we get started... Um, I wanted to say farewell to my five puppies. Um, I placed them in some great homes. I shared their pictures with the owners all over my Facebook, and I think I really chose some good parents, adoptive parents. But boy, is it quiet around the house. I, I have missed them. Um, I brought them to where they need to be, and uh, they're great little puppies. But boy, it's heart-wrenching when they will, will have to leave my house. So they went out the door. I now have two cones on two puppies' heads because I had both my females fixed, and they will not be another litter in the house. But anyway, you guys, hang on. I want to show you this stuff. Jason, I started trying these pieces on in the other room. Oh, my gosh. You sent me some super cute things. So I'm going to set this thing down here, and let's see if I don't knock it over. And straighten it up, and I'm going to tilt it forward a little because I want you to see what he sent me. Now, you're going to see my insulin pump there. That's what that is. This is the cardigan that I have been, I've been seeing these long cardigans out everywhere. I like, I like the fact he asked me to, to pair it up with this little top that he sent. 
And I got these leggings in another box um, not too long ago. So, you know, just with a pair of, because my husband is short. I'm going to the movies today, guys. And this might be a great outfit to wear the movies because you know how they always keep the theaters like 20 below in there? This might help. So I may, let me flip around here so you can see it. But I may um, buy this and this for, for sure because I do like it. It's soft, uh, very, it's not really thick. I saw some yesterday that were a thicker weave and um, I liked this better. So um, let me take this off so I can show you the top. Okay, show you this over here. And you can see this, it's an asymmetrical top. Kind of, it looks like a mixed material. No. Yeah, the material is a little bit non-stretchy. It's, it's a little stretchier up here. So it's kind of a mixed material. It has little side slats on this side, but not on this side. Um, the top, let me show you that, is... Ah, got some little detail cuts right here. Okay, so hang on a second, and I'm going to try on the necklace and the shoes and that fuchsia top, and I'm going to keep it with the black leggings. So hang on a second, and I will be right back. Jason, thank you for this birthday fix. Um, I want to show you what <laughs> I thought I'm going to think about to keep all this stuff. Now, the one worry I have is the, the big wedge shoes, but I thought, well, if I'm just going out to eat somewhere and I'm with my granddaughter, I could throw these shoes on her. Maybe if Dan's, my husband, is okay, he'll let me wear these big shoes. But, um, um, and I'm sure he would. He likes it when I look tall. But I have to worry about my feet. But anyway, I want to show you this little top, the fuchsia top. I paired it with this little necklace. You can see that the little lunar planet necklace, which is super cute. I like this necklace. And I'm going to scoot back, or I'm going to come up here and change this camera around so you can see the wedges. Hang on a second. And here we are. There they are. Now, if I fall, ah, I'm dead. So <laughs> But maybe if I'm really careful and walk really slow, I'll be okay. But anyway, the top, kind of, you can pull it down over the rear end. It's a little bit longer in the back. And what I like about this top, too, is I like this collar. Um, I, it's a little different. It's just not just a flat collar. It kind of comes up a little bit. I like that. So, Jason, if you see any more t uh, sweaters like this, I really like that. Um, but anyway, cute necklace. I find the whole box. Happy birthday to me. So, ugh. anyway, I have made it to 60. And there's a celebration to this because when I was a kid and I was diagnosed with juvenile diabetes, I was told by my doctor, who was an old-time doctor, Donna, I don't mean to scare you, but you'll probably not live to be past the age of 59. Yikes. Then I had two cousins who had type 1 that died at 52 and 59. So I do have a few days to wait. If I don't show up at 60 for my next video, you'll know what happened. But I have tried to take care of myself the best of my ability. And hopefully I'll be around for the next 20 years or 30. You never know. It's because I did have an aunt that lived to be, she got it when she was in her 20s and lived to be 93. So you just never know. Dr. Black, I'm still here. So anyway, please subscribe to me. And I think I'm going to do another box this month, right? Right before, I don't know. But I'm going to do another box in September. I need fall clothes. I don't know about you guys, but I've been looking. I'm not seeing a lot out there that I can just, that looks good on me. And But gosh, Jason, you nailed this. Happy birthday to me. Anyway, I'll let you guys go. Please subscribe to me, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.